I believe. I believe. Godspeed, snipers. Thanatos. Hold your own and never surrender. Hello everyone, I'm Kibitz and welcome back to They Are Billions. The campaign might be done, but oh brother, there are like a billion more custom maps to play. Including this one, which is called Nemesis City. In which we have to take on this massive, super massive in fact, infected village of doom. And all the giants that reside in it while trying to defend against constant waves that are attacking from the east and the west. However, we have a very nice starting location where we get to freely set up a massive city and make a huge army to take on the city. Yes, tell me and of course, you. since the game was updated, we have many, 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 many more things to try out and test. So I'm going to set up my little starter city here, you call that and we'll get going. Uh-oh. And looks like uh, we got a mirror that brings power. <laughs> and, you know, that sounds like a good thing, but whenever the map is that nice to you, it only means bad things are coming. In fact, look at our entire starting area. Ooh. Architect, thank you. Like, we have this huge area to set up a super defense. Oh gosh, and here come the zombies. So if we're setting up a huge super defense here, yeah, we are going to be dealing with a lot. And if this many infected are just rolling on in by day one, oh boy, things are gonna get interesting, let me tell ya. Uh, uh oh, and we got a bonus 10 Thanatos, just willy nilly. Wait, now we got an Atlas Transmutator as a, just a free bonus? I present your mayoral candidate. Um, it's day 11. Oh yeah, we're gonna be in for it this map, let me tell ya. Alright, so it begins east and southwest. So that's over here and down here. Well, the game's given us a lot, so I expect the worst. Alright, well here we go. Also, I just realized we might call over a giant and then... Then we got a problem. So it's looking like normal infected. It might be a lot of normal infected. That's all right, we can handle them. Oh my gosh, look at the mini-map. <laughs> That's intimidating. But we got Thanatos, we can handle all the normal infected in the world. Though admittedly that is quite, quite a bit. Quite a bit. Maybe you should have built a shocking tower? Maybe? Oh, but that's it. <laughs> I'd say that's it, this is like a mini Cape Storm, but you know that's it, right? Goodness gracious. Goodness gracious. But now the Thanatos get to have fun. And they're not gonna stand a chance. No way. Way too many Thanatos. We'll put one on strongest on each side. There's no way we're going down, right? Um. They're getting to the wall. They shouldn't be getting to the wall. Uh oh. Spaghetti yo. Um. We might be dead. Oh no, the walls aren't even getting hit. You see, it only looks terrifying, but in actuality, we're totally fine. I think it might be about that time to start building units, though. Might be an idea. Oh, but now chubbies are just randomly attacking. Uh oh. That probably means that the next waves are going to be just all chubbies. That's bad. That's the big bad. Okay, good. And by about day 20 here, Academy of Immortals. Beautiful. And 56 snipers. We got to pump those numbers up. We, 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 we up. Like we need 100 snipers right now. So, oh, here we go again. Um, yeah, we needed 100 snipers before the next wave. And I guess uh, we're a little late on that. All right, but here comes the party. Oh boy, oh boy. Thank goodness we have so many snipers here. In fact, let's get these guys right up next to the gate. 
and get building some more. 16 soldier centers? Not bad. Not bad at all. Get sold position. I'm really happy I built those extra walls. <laughs> and maybe a couple of the shocking towers could be nice too. Yeah? Probably. In, do you have anything neat? Extra Titan? Uh, I think it'd be cheaper just to buy my own. If I had any oil, never mind. Congratulations, buddy. You lucked out. Alright, though. Weave is kind of petering out. Yeah, the Thanatos still kind of have that covered. Also, all the extra sniper towers help a little bit as well. So, I think it is time. We go on the offensive. It is time to take on the great city and destroy all the giants in the nonsense before things get even worse. Okay, but like seriously, we need this area kind of like taken over in the next couple of days here. Like we really gotta get moving on it. Like the giants gotta go. Everybody gotta go. Snipers, just wipe them out. We gotta get all the food. That's kind of like the main thing. We gotta grow our economy. It's really important. Right. Ooh. Mutant. Yeah, you know what? A mutant could help a little bit. You go up over here and have some fun, buddy. Zombie City versus Mutant. I have my money on that mutant. And giant number two is down. Beautiful. And what is this, giant number three? Yep. Man, when they have only 10,000 health, dang. They kind of get rolled. Uh-oh. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. We might be attacked by giants right now. Uh, okay. Um, I guess we should have filled a, maybe a couple more towers. And yeah, we'll do that with the next couple loads of units. I set up all the wooden towers we need, though. Because that's kind of all we need to worry about. We don't need a crazy range upgrade, nor do we need to actually worry about the defenses all too much. Because there's only one bridge for them to cross. Also, I did unlock the landmines as well, so maybe we can try these guys out. Don't think I ever used them in the campaign. So, I don't know. Maybe they're good, maybe they're bad. Wow, they get set up fast. Oh, and you can set a timer. Uh, this will activate after one second, three sec- Ooh! So a zombie walks over it, then a couple seconds later, big boom. Yeah, let's set that to three seconds. That sounds great. Alright, well, here comes the horde. Uh, this might be a little spooky. Let's spend a little bit of money. Let's upgrade some of these farms. And let's see what we're dealing with. Harpies! Of course harpies. Yeah, I guess it's about that time. Alright. So be it. We do have a lot of sniper towers though, so they should handle that quite well. Oh no! Ooh, that could be kind of bad. The harpies are gonna set off the landmines. But that's for the other zombies. Stop! Stop! <laughs> oh man. Well, I guess it dealt with the harpies. Well, I kind of wanted the landmines to blow these guys up. Wait, we have time to set up more? And they actually only take like half a second, so it's like, we're all good. Wait, did the line mines blow up the walls though? Do they blow up my stuff? Hey, that's not cool, man. Not cool at all. Oh, but now here we go. All the timers are set, right? Yes. So now in a couple seconds, all of them go boom! Oh, and the explosives, the explosives do blow up my own things. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Nor is my mutant dying a good thing. Oh. Yeah, mutant versus giant, uh, that's gonna be a problem there. That's okay. This is looking good. Yep, the wave is done, but the harpies never stop. So just casual infinite harpies for the rest of forever. Why not? Probably about that time we start filling up some more of these sniper towers, though. And, like, seriously clearing out this area as well. Like these guys, this whole town gotta go. Uh oh. They are approaching from the east. They seem to have found a big fella. A mutant? No, of course it's gonna be a giant. Oh brother! Oh, uh, we are not I don't think we're clearing fast enough here. 
B34, already giants. I think this is a 100 day map. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. Oh boy. Here we go. Here we go. I don't even want to look at it. All right, one giant so far. One giant from this side. Of course, the harpies and the old good pals. All right, on. Might need a couple more walls. Maybe this is a good idea. Ooh, and I should have been filling these towers up by now. This is looking bad. Oh, but he's getting stuck. He's trying to get to this tower. Oh, no. He's too smart. Too wise, too intelligent. But here's the big problem with the giants. It's not because they're dangerous in themselves, but I always have to have my snipers targeting the strongest. So, usually the other zombies slip through the cracks, and that's the danger zone. Let's upgrade a couple of these. Oh, the giants are down, though. Well, that's good. Now we only have this to deal with. Oh, and this could be uh, hyper bad. Let's send a couple of these guys back. Oh, this is actually extremely hyper bad. They're gonna infect all of my buildings that I've been working on. We need those. Okay, but most of them are focused still on the main defense. All right, just handle this, please. Um, where are my titans? Uh, titans, you are now gonna handle this, okay? Move back here as fast as you can. Let's not have everything get infected. Everything is getting infected. Fantastic. But at least the wave's done. Sniper is ready. All right. So minor inconvenience, really. Not bad, not bad. Okay, and now the war front's doing pretty dang well. We are punching through into the main heart of the city, and whoa, the resources we're gaining are insane. Alrighty, and the last little remnants of this town are being obliterated. Now we just have a couple of giants to deal with. And with our army of snipers all ready to go. <laughs> um, yeah. Giants are about to get the big oof. So, holy snap. Gents, go get them. Mutants, destroy these last couple houses. And let's clear the map finally. Uh oh. They are approaching from the east. Service. Their assaults are endless? Does that mean, like, they're never gonna stop attacking in, like, swarm versions now? Cause that'd be bad! Okay. Well, we are pretty set up, like, I've made these anti-harpy defenses, which is essentially just one wall, line of wasp turrets, on each side. And that should help out quite a bit. And then, we're gonna add in just a ton of landmines for the memes. Okay, ready for fun, guys? I'm not. Three giants, though? Four giants? Okay, not bad. It's kind of what we're used to. Five giants? Okay, now we're getting a little spicy here. A little, a little bit spicy. Is it just the five giants? Not a problem. <laughs> they didn't even get to the landmines. Oh, that's great. Boop! And... <laughs> the landmines own! It's definitely not the snipers here. Those landmines. They cause fear. Alright, now the harpies are gonna deal with the rest. Maybe? No. No! <laughs> oh, landmines. I gotta make a landmine based custom map. That'd be a ton of fun. It's looking like we're good there with the giants gone. And at this point now, I'm just upgrading the sniper towers for a little bit of extra range and trying to build as many Thanatos as literally possible. Oh, and brick this whole thing. Like, we're gonna get attacked probably from here, here, and this entire side. So there's no way we're holding that. So I'm just gonna scoop up all the resources I can, make all the oil units I can while I can secure this production, and then we're gonna hide. Hide in a very comfy, cozy bunker. Oh, and wait a second. Is that the whole wave? Oh. Yo, that's not too, that's not too bad at all, actually. Not too bad at all. Let's build our extra Atlas transmutator. And I guess we're... Oh! I get it now. 
That's the steam. That steam wave is gonna constantly attack for the rest of the game now. Okay, dude. Now I now I truly understand. Oh no, never mind. It's only one giant at a time. So what we're dealing with before plus a giant. Okay, now that's not too bad. We wipe waves like that for breakfast. Will they ever stop? No. No, they won't. But neither shall we. Our sniper yeah. numbers looking good. Almost at a thousand strong. Uh, Thanatos almost at a hundred. Could be a bit better there. Should be at about a 150 at this point, but nothing to complain about. And honestly, I'm just stuffing most of the snipers I can into the central area. And they're not even going to go into towers. At least not most of them. Most of them I just want in the space. Range is not the main concern. But what do we have in this wave? I'm gonna guess 10 giants, yeah? Four? Oh, don't tease me. There's five. Already a little bit of stutter. Beautiful, I'm seeing it. Only five? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Spitty boys have been introduced. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now things get a little bit more interesting. Oh, and here come more giants. I knew it wouldn't just be five. It's never just five. Okay. We're holding them back for now. Clearly not for long. All the DPS in the world couldn't really handle this. That's like Thanatos territory. That's why I'm trying to get as many as literally possible. We need every Thanatos. This whole area needs to be Thanatos. In fact, now that I mention it, I should probably get rid of the wasp turrets in here. Because at this point, everything just needs to explode. Okay, though. Looks like the wave oh, has been melted. At least the main wave. And now just the other waves are getting a little bit more spicy. D57, though. I think by the next wave, we are going to be invincible. Now then, we're kind of on the end times here. I think the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to try and block off this area a decent amount. Like probably add in a couple of walls, a couple of turrets, etc, etc. Because there's a small chance that the zombies don't attack from here and only pour in from here. And if that's the case, if I set up a decent little distraction here, that might buy us extremely valuable time. Oh yeah, and as for this defense as well, since we know it's gonna fall, why not just set up a nice, comfy little minefield behind it? Good plan? I think so. You know how you really make a good use of this? We're gonna cover all the empty spots. Oh. We're gonna try to cover all of the empty spots in walls. So all the zombies will group in front of the wall, one will break through, trip the landmine, and then kaboom! Actually, you know what? If we undo all these, we just make the huge wood wall area first and then fill it with landmines, that'll be a little bit better, right? Yeah. A swarm of infected is heading into the colony. They are approaching from the west. Oh. They attack from the west? From this direction? But my minefield's up here. Team? This this is this is against the rules. Okay. Um well we have a mutant still, so he got this, right? Yeah. I guess we'll just build the minefield over here then. Sure, why not? We can cover this entire western flank in like the next 21 hours for sure. Oh yeah, we are. We're done for. Big oo. There go some of the landmines that set them to the three second delay. Harpy's just running around. Actually, this is triggering too many landmines. Uh, zero. It's just the harpies. I don't want them jumping every over every single landmine and activating every one. Yeah, this is really bad. Real, real bad. 
Yes. Okay. And this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna use the mutant over here as damage control. We're gonna stop the infection from spreading too far over this way. Obviously, we can't stop the giants. But we can hopefully stop enough of this. And man, that minefield did nothing. <laughs> they, they rolled over it so quickly. Oh no, and the giants! Uh oh. Okay, we have one job. Pull the giants to the main wall. Holy game lag. Jesus. This wave. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, make it, make it, make it, make it, and hold. All right, we pulled like three of the giants over. Rest of the area, it's screwed. We're gonna lose a housing block. Our economy is gonna go in the pooper. Uh, now we watch the world burn as two giants just run amok throughout my entire outbound economy. Though at least we survived the attack. Already negative 5,000 gold income? Yep, the entire village is dead. Now getting infected. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god. Look at how far they got through this wall. This is our final line of defense. And they got through that much. That's an oof. That's a hyper oof. Uh, now all this is gonna loop back around to the defense too. Oh, and great. There's still a giant alive, because why not? I wonder if the landmines still work if there's no power, actually. Probably, right? Oh, but the giant doesn't care about the landmines. He's just going for the expensive defense over here. I see. I get it. Oh, and even more fun, the landmine doesn't work when there's no power. Cool. Oh, they do. Oh, but he's so far out that he's just gonna reheal once. Okay. All right. That's really bad. Yeah, we gotta put a we gotta put a stop to this. We're moving some snipers out of the defense. And look at this. I can't believe this zombie. I actually can. Dodges literally the whole minefield to go after the most important buildings. Like, for real, man. For real. Yes. Alright, you guys go and take out the walkers. Oh, this is going to take years to rebuild. Years. Okay, but the giant's dead at least. Just rip like 20,000 gold in defenses there. So many targets. Cool. Very cool. And let's wipe out the rest of this. Repair what we can. And you know what? Screw the landmines. Uh, or screw the wall strategy. I don't think that works very well. I think a better option is just simply gonna be using wire traps. Oh yeah, pro tip, if you're ever losing like a huge area like this, try and click on the Tesla towers and repair them first. Then you can go in and repair like the most critical buildings possible. Like your gold mines and things of that nature. Infected is heading into the colony. Oh my god, are you kidding me? It's been two days! Two days! Oh my god. Okay, west and north, so everything I just repaired is going up in smoke! Oh boy. Oh boy. Um, screw you. Screw you. We still have a lot of landmines, I guess, up here. Oh no. <laughs> All right, it might be that point in the game where I start salvaging everything attacked. I built. Yeah, it might be that point. So I just destroy everything that I can. Get the money out of that so I don't go hyper negative. Go from there. Can we at least get positive for a second? We don't have any food. We're not getting even positive for a second. Okay, let's repair the wall. Time to die. And then hindsight being 2020, should I have actually made the minefields? And should I have just actually tried to defend these areas? And honestly, I don't think I should have. Yeah, there's no way I could have held all this. There's no way. Like even if I had defenses like these, 
This is too much. And from the northwest as well? Okay, there we go. Music's fixed. Not as annoying anymore. <laughs> now at least we can enjoy our death, right? Right. Alright, so long as we can stop, like, snipers deserting too much, we can actually hold on for quite a bit. That's all we have to do. These waves aren't, like, super massive. They're chunky. Not super massive. Just, yeah, super <laughs> They're super chunky, actually. What am I saying? In our economy, can't just live on iron in our wood. <laughs> Stop! Everything's dying. Everything's being destroyed. Alrighty. The giants are down, though. Cool. One, our one of our main defenses is almost down, though, too. Also cool. I target strongest, you target closest. We gotta keep our eye on the markets here. Oh, that's where! Northwest. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Oh, and the power's already down, so you know. <laughs> There's just nothing there. Okay. Well, if this is the case, we're salvaging what we can. Landmines will do whatever landmines want to do. Okay, yeah, could have been a lot worse. <laughs> Looks like they just ripped the defense apart, and now this last wave is going to come and boop the last little bit. Okay. I want to send some out, but I think we have to... No, we are going to send a, some out. We're going to send, like, eight just out into the wild. And then hunker back down. I think we're just going to use wood walls. Because our economy is so bad. Yeah, we gotta save the dollar reduce. It's gonna be far worse if we lose more snipers. Far worse. Alright, you guys move up. Let's actually defend this. There we go. Just a couple more walls. See, that little chunk just took out two giants right there. Pretty good! We have managed to hold on, at least. Okay, and we might have a second, actually, to repair a bit. One more zombie up there. Don't think I don't see you. Okay. And we've checked everything else, so it's just this one. Get him. And let's start the slow and tedious repairing process as we lose more snipers from desertion. Very cool. The beginning of the end. Okay, I am going to presume that's the final wave. Is that a safe presumption? I think so. So let us prepare for the beginning of the end. No music though? Hello? Ring ring, hello? Apparently not. That's all right. We will make do. And all we can really do defensive wise is salvage most of our base and try and make wire traps. I think wire traps are going to be the best thing we can do out here. They don't require power. They do a lot more damage than just one explosive. And if we put them in front of our walls, they actually don't destroy our own defenses, which is kind of important. Oh, we're going to die. Here comes the first waves. Oh boy, attacking from every direction, why not? Okay, let's delete everything we can. Scrape every last dollar out of these defenses and make everything we possibly can. This is gonna be a long and perilous night. Many snipers will flee and even more will die. But we will try and hold on as long as we can. And one little ranger, get all of the iron. You're solely creating the final defenses for our entire base. It's all up to you. That's not even a joke. Like, this last bit of iron is going to kill thousands of zombies. Thousands. It's of incredible importance. Alright, forget about everything else. There's billions of giants. There's millions of problems. Run. Run. Run! Run! Oh my god, my game. <laughs> Just run for your life! And houses. Goodbye. 
All right, and that's all the rest. That's all she wrote. Uh, as for in here, we're probably gonna lose quite a bit of ground. Just cover it in more spikes. Anything we can possibly do. In Ranger, just run. Just run, 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 run. Farms, goodbye, good night. Oh no. Little Miss Ranger, you've done a great job. Thank you for your service. But you're doomed! Doomed! Oh no. To the wall! Let her in! Let her in! Open the door! There's no door. No! Little Miss Ranger. And there goes our economy again. Okay. Very cool. Very cool. So now we just keep our eye on the market. We have to sell stone like it ain't nobody's business. All the wire traps already dead, but the ones that survived doing a lot of work. Oh man, brother! There's so many giants! 1,400 snipers, though. That's gonna do it, let me tell ya. This is gonna be a mess, but we'll hold out over here. How's the south looking? What <laughs> is this, like 20 giants? They're not gonna actually even make it. Me, okay, maybe they'll make it, but like for the moat? Okay, I don't even know. There's nothing positive to say. This is really spooky. This area especially, like if I tried to hold like on the, on the west here, way too big of a defense. Here, same, same, like this is where I had to help. This is where I had to hold. Maybe at the end of the day, I should have made more snipers. Like maybe have 3,000? Less Thanatos, but once the defenses hit, like, right in here, that's where we're gonna be at our strongest. Did more giants come to attack? Wait, is this, like, too low? Oh my gosh, there's, like, 20 giants. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. We're losing our snipers now. Which you think would be a bad thing, but we're gonna lose a lot to them fleeing anyway. So this is something we kind of have to just ex accept. How's this looking? Giants making their way over. Okay. This side, a lot of the giants already down, but most of the giant wave hasn't even got there yet. Okay. Does this side have any more giants? Nope, just chubbies for years. Oh boy. This is gonna be one of those games, isn't it? All right though, honestly, there's not all too much we can do. Either we ride. Or we die, brother! Godspeed, snipers! Thanatos, hold your own, and never surrender! Custom maps, custom maps, custom maps. Good God. This is kind of what I come to expect. Just thousands and thousands of giants pouring in from every direction. Snipers horrifically trying to keep up with impossible odds. Yeah. I miss these, man. Good to be back playing them. However, I think this is an infinite final wave. 
That's gonna go straight to D100. And it's D94. I don't think we're gonna last through another six days of this. Like, we're heading into our Thanatos area, which is our strongest part of our defense. But the Thanatos here and here have to hold both this side and all of this. I don't know how well that's gonna work, to be honest. Um, for one, these guys kind of have to be on closest. Because there's kind of a, you know, danger close happening right now. And yeah, I guess we just have to wait and see. This part of the defense is really good too. But, <laughs> I don't know if we could cram enough Thanatos into it to make it as good as it could be. Looking at this in hindsight, I really should have deleted all the sniper towers around here. And just a brick of Thanatos. Like, 300 just right up in there. Having them spread out all over the place will be my end. And here we are, the greatest choke point on the whole map. We have all the Thanatos, probably like 200 left. How many days though? <laughs> Four days to survive, with five feet between our ultimate demise and our command center. You think we got this? We might, we're kind of holding them at bay. It actually might be a little close. Wait, what? What was that? They are approaching from the north. Um, this is it. Hold them off for the win. Oh, we have 48 hours. That's it? Two days? So day 98 and that's it? Now two days is actually even closer. Maybe we could do this here. I believe. I believe. Hold strong, Thanatos. Ride or die, brothers. Wait! Wait, 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 wait! And the waves are even stopping! Wait, is this it? We're on the last horde of zombies before it's over? Oh, but we're losing our Thanatos. We can't... Did we get this close? Please! Hold on! Oh my gosh! 33 more hours! Everything is explosions! Oh, they're right there though! Legit though, it's this close, I'm actually gonna block off my command center. It's actually gotten this close. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I think we actually did it. 12 hours. The north, all the northern waves have been defeated. Are you kidding me? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. An extra wall, dude. We did it. That seals the deal. Seals the deal. Thanatos OP. But we did lose like a thousand snipers, so. That wasn't the most clean of victories, but a victory! Nonetheless. Six hours. I can't believe this side never actually was an issue. Like the whole game. That's kind of weird. Goes to show, like, how much, like, two tiles of a choke point can matter. One hour, though! Give me the victory. They have 
trying to break through. Okay, there we go. Music's fixed. And this is it. I guess we have to survive for two more days. Simply where we're at. I think we might be able to. Just barely. It's gonna be so close though. Just because we could build those walls, but there's so many giants just coming in now. Or wait, is this actually just a proper final wave? looking like it. It's not infinitely respawning. This is it. I guess this is it. No, there's just too many giants though. This is like 50 giants. Yeah, there's like literally like 50 giants here. We don't have enough anything for this. Even this area is not holding. And we only have how many Thanatos left? 132? Look, that's a decent chunk of Thanatos, but not against 50 giants. And Pretty much already destroyed defenses. Alright, are you all on strongest? You better be. Alright, yeah, I can't let... I'm thinking like, try to destroy the towers and bring more snipers over, but... We need to do the preemptive damage. Like, they're coming into this area at half health, and we have to have that. Have to have that. Oh god, they're already through the walls. We're losing more Thanatos. I think we're through the majority of the giants, though. Come on! We lost 10! Ooh! Most giants are down though! My god, are we gonna- Are we going to survive? Unbelievable. Unbelievable! The giants are down! The giants are down, we did it! Let me tell you guys. I usually know when we win or when we lose. And once we lost this whole area, within a couple of days, I was like, it's over. There's no way. No way in a million years. I cannot believe how proven wrong I've been with this video. This is actually, I still don't even believe it. I don't know how we did it. Actually, it's just actually incredible. Wow. Actually, wow. Almost half a million infected killed. Thousand soldiers lost. In no world, in no world did I think we would win. I was saying, like, in hindsight, I wish I did A, X, X, Y, and Z, and that, that legitimately may have been the closest Lair Billion scheme I've ever played. That was ridiculous. Uh, anyway, though, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, more of the Air Billions custom maps to come, so don't worry. But anyway, that's gonna be all for today. So have a fantastic rest of your day, and bye bye